Hello YouTube, my name is Ajaj Patel and I am from webhub.blogspot.com. Welcome to the part 2 of e-commerce website in PHP with PDO. Last tutorial, we take a quick overview of user site and in this tutorial, we will take a quick overview of admin site. Admin site is only accessible by our website owner and it is not accessible by any guest users so I have one admin so I enter my admin name and give the password like uh, okay this is not my email so I remove it and I say my password and click on login button okay here it is our admin panel is coming so here is the overview or you can say it is a statistic of our website here it is 41 product is available in our website 8 categories are available in our website total 5 brands shipping orders total orders order pendings total customers discount products out of stock products and this list shipping location and total page views okay so let's take a first view all products it's display all the products which is available in our website and here it is one searching facility of all the products uh, you can uh, search here any product in the website okay here is the one option like edit so if if someone edit this product so he can also edit this okay look at here we add some okay here it is multicolor so we say we don't need multicolor we 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 need multicolors okay now when i click on update so it say product updated successfully let's check now what happened okay so look at here multicolors are updated so our perfect our website is perfect running so product image product price discount selling price product features all the description are available here in the admin site okay guys now let's check okay i will show you one more thing here if users uh, admin want to delete more than one product so he can also delete more than one products or if he want to delete a single product then he also delete by clicking this button okay so guys or or and also sorry need to refresh some problems are occur but we will fix in our project so here it is the view by categories if okay it is not work now so i'll go to add new products if user admin want to add a new product then he enter this his description and add product when he add product and if the main category was electronic so it will be shown here here our new products are shown automatically okay so let's check out of stock products okay multi colors out of stock product it is out of stock product so let's check where is the multi okay find it find it find it okay i i uh, i was forgot one more thing i don't uh, show you this electronics and crockery and this pages so uh, let's check out this okay electronics look at here our all the products are have electronic categories is shown here and also the subcategory of electronics category which is shown here and also the number of product inside our subcategory is also shown here like emergency light have 17 products LED bulb have two product header one product user can easily navigate by clicking here okay and one more thing uh, one more thing guys i also show you how to add this icon in our tab 
so let's take back okay so now out of stock product is 2 let's edit this okay electronics and brand name Philips get back find in electronics okay here it is multicolor click it and check it here is the status is available out of stock so if the product is out of stock then the button is not showing like buy it now and add to cart it only show the add, add to wishlist button okay guys so let's get back and go to discount here are all the products are available which have a discount added by admin so admin can anytime change the discounts and also delete these products and anything okay on demand products which means which uh, it's so that product which is buy highly okay let's check a uh, view categories okay if uh, first of all I uh, show you something look at here observe here here are eight categories now we add more categories like here so I say mobiles it is for only the demonstration purpose so let's get to click on add category okay look at here category added successfully when I click OK now scroll down look at here mobile category is available now let's refresh and check refresh and check our home page okay look at here guys observe here mobile is available in our menu here it is okay so it is a fully dynamic now if I want to delete this so I can also delete this by clicking delete button okay so prompt appear here are you sure okay category deleted successfully okay now again refresh it and check it what happened here look at here mobile are now not available so it is the beauty of PHP okay now we add some subcategories if someone add subcategories admin have so first of all you need to select electronics and then he entered the new subcategory name and add so it is automatically added all the brands are appear here you uh, admin can anytime add new brands or delete existing brands now here is the most important thing here is the user area so how many users are registration in our website and here is the full information of our all users like his name username email id phone number password cities all the information registration date is also display here okay guys now go to view all completed orders but we don't have any orders completed so let's check a uh, pending orders so here it is the pending orders if I click on confirm order so okay the order is confirmed now now look at here we all complete order here we have a one order completed okay so here is the option generate bill admin can also generate his bill now we let's get back to add oh sorry confirm or some new orders so confirm it okay look at here two orders now available in our order list and also check our overview look at here total order 2 which is completed and pending order 5 let's check a pending order okay here it is five uh, five is the pending orders now again click on one more confirm okay here it is three now check overview 
look at here total order shift 3 and total order pending 4 ok guys let's check a cancel order here is the one cancel order is available here let's cancel some more orders by going to my account ok here is my account go to my orders if I cancel this ok look at this look at here our status is changed first completed this order are completed but if I cancel the order of JBL flip in process so I will cancel it ok order cancel successfully now come back here and check cancel orders look at here two now two orders are cancelled here and also go to overview and check ok look at here two orders are cancelled now now add a more pin codes like uh, if you uh, admin want to add new pin code like I have entered uh, I need like uh, 39 uh, 6060 ok and city will be like uh, anything ABC or add pin code pin code added successfully ok here look at here ABC and 396060 available ok now check come into your look at first of all look at here our products are changed now because we updated it it's first so it will be the here now what is our pin code our pin code is 396060 ok so I will check 396061 first of all we enter wrong so it will give the error like shipping is not available in your location ok fine if I enter a right pin code like 396060 and check it ok look at here shipping is available in please proceed because of we have a pin code ok guys then next we here is the most beautiful and most important function of our website that admin can anytime change our image slider which is run in our home page here is the image slider admin can anytime change our image slider here is the six images are available in our slider so admin can anytime choose a new image and update then it's perform here and change the images okay we also take this so come back or in your view order i want to show you something so find out view complete orders okay here it is okay look at here carefully here is the one option generate bill ok guys so if I click on generate bill then here is the bill are available of our website uh, our product so like order and order id will be this ok invoice date is this seller will be royal collection buyer adjust portal phone number and all information about user here is the product name, product quantity, price and subtotal. Ok guys. When I click on print. Then our computerized bill will be generated. If I want to save as a PDF then we, uh, I can also. And if I want to print then I can also but I not attach the printer so right now we cannot print this ok guys so simply just cancel it come back to your overview main page ok so guys here is our most beautiful and most attractive admin panel which is not accessible by anyone it is only accessible by our website owner ok guys user can or uh, admin can also uh, check out all the products by clicking here view more ok so it show you all the products 
also check the all the categories by clicking here it is the statistic you can say it is the statistic of our website like 559 okay let's uh, close it and again open it and look at this uh, check out what happened okay when we open and refresh it okay look at here 5960 uh, we we will create in our project this whole things okay here is the option for admin admin logout we can also create a logout system for the admin okay so simply i log out in our my system so it will come back so guys it is the quick overview of uh, about our admin panel so guys in next tutorial we start working on our project so guys stay connected with me and guys if you like my videos then come uh, like share and if you have any question in your mind then comment below or guys one more thing don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel it is very benefit for you for latest update of my channel so guys stay connected with me and thanks for watching guys see you in next tutorial goodbye